Hello, my little slices of pumpkin pie. I am Winter, and I'm back in my Ultra Flat Core Challenge. We are still looking for obsidian and diamonds, aren't we? Mm, yes, we are. Not good at all. Not good at all. Uh, I already checked out that smithy. Yes, I think so. And so, here I am again. Uh, with the challenge of getting out from this church in a possible safe way. Uh, so there's a slime tracking me somewhere. Right here. Let's take care of those. Hi. Let's mm, not, maybe, not waste my sword on these guys. I know there's more, there has to be more. How big are you? Oh, you're pretty big. Is that a creeper? Oh, oh, shoot. No, no, no. S stay away. Creeper, stay away. Okay? Yeah, away. Away you stay, I say. Uh, should I make a run for it? There's nothing on my left, so yeah. Oh, go! Go! Leave! Leave this accursed place! Where is west? The west is this way! Hooray! We are free! Ah, so how are you today? <laughs> ah... I have been thinking about the future of this challenge. I mentioned already that I will consider myself done after I manage to build a giant platform island thingy up there in the sky where the slimes will not spawn because it's uh, above layer 40. And I've been thinking about what exactly to build. Uh, I am not a very good builder, so I don't think you, you will not see awesome castles from me. <laughs> uh, full of bridges and towers. Uh, but at the same time, I mean, after, after I, I'm finished running from village to village, it will, this video here will only be about me building stuff, so I don't want to just build a square in the sky and call it a day. It would be kind of lame. So what I needed was something that was at the same time simple enough for me to build, uh, but uh, something more than just uh, a square or a circle, really. Uh, and possibly also not something completely random, but something that, uh, I don't know, has something to do with me uh, in some kind of way. Something that, you know, that only I would build, or only someone like me would build. And thinking and thinking and thinking, I think I came up with something. Uh, and so I'm going to tell you exactly what it is. Uh, <laughs> I have a hobby. I enjoy playing 8-ball, uh, a, a pool game. Uh, probably, I guess, the most, uh, the better known one, the better pool game known, uh, the better known pool game. <laughs> uh, there are no villages here. Uh, blah. I play 8-ball, the one game where you're supposed to, you play on a table and you have a queue, and you're supposed to hit balls in a certain order, and uh, you're playing against an opponent, and you need to finish putting all your balls in the pockets before the other guy. Uh, I play eight ball, as I said, with, uh, where the, the objective is, uh, there are uh, seven balls, all of a different color, don't stop sprinting right here. Uh, seven balls, then a, uh, a black ball, and then seven more balls, and the, the first seven are, are one color, and are, these are called spots. And uh, the other seven balls are, instead of a white stripe around them, and they are called stripes. <laughs> uh, 
one player has uh, the spots and the other player has the stripes and the objective is to pocket them all and once you only the ones you are assigned and once you have pocketed <laughs> all of your balls you have to put the black one in the pockets uh, meh. anybody outside? don't surprise me ok let's kill this guy here and run got some more gold, I can make myself another golden apple, that's cool or I can make a gold block which would allow me to make health potions if I find the first vill uh, villager that tra will trade me watermelons that's cool, that's perfectly fine um, then there's also, of course, the white ball, which is the only ball you are allowed to hit with your Q, and it's the one you use to hit the other balls and put them in the pockets. So you may see where this is going. Uh, not only I'm not a very good builder, but even if I was, I would not be able to do anything too amazing because I have limited materials in this kind of challenge in a super flat world so I can't get all colored kind of wools and most blocks are either very hard to obtain or absolutely impossible to obtain so uh, a pool table is uh, usually the, the let's say the classical one uh, usually is brown with uh, uh, with a a surface that is either green or blue or red, uh, more usually green and uh, well green and brown are the colors of dirt and grass which uh, even if it uh, is not very very easy to collect and it will take a while to get all of that dirt those are the two colors I definitely do have so yeah I want to build a pool table um, this is, I mean, building a table, that should be something that even I can do. <laughs> and uh, I think it would be nice to have this giant table in the middle of nowhere with... Uh, uh, I will not be able to... Wow, yes, two! Only two! Only two! <laughs> well, these are my first diamonds, so I'm not going to complain. Although I sure wish I had more. I will look for more. Uh, oh, another smithy, that's cool. Let's try to avoid the slimes on my way there. Uh, for example, by going here. Boop, and boop, and boop. And where's the entrance? Here's the entrance. More diamonds? Ah, more iron, however, that's cool. How many swords do I have? I don't think I need this many. Well, as long as I have space in my inventory, I guess I'll take them. Hi. Can I get that out from here? And by get out from here, I mean safely. Great. Great! I got my first two diamonds. That's cool! Mm. Pool table. Yes, I think having this giant pool table uh, would be great as it would be, you know, the just one flat green surface when I have where I will have possibly a chance to spawn animals uh, I will not be able to make all the colored uh, all, all the colors uh, for making all of the balls so I guess I will have to do without some of them the colors are um, there are uh, there are two of every color, as I said, but one uh, has a white stripe around it. Uh, there's red, orange, yellow, green, blue, um, purple, and another kind of red, a uh, reddish purple, and I never learned the name of. <laughs> and also, there's, of course, the black one and the white one. Uh, and I will never be able to make. Uh, um, there are too many slimes here, I just want to sleep, damn it. Give me the bed. Are you following me? You are. 
hopefully this will be safe enough to sleep in. Sleep! Thank you. Good night! And good morning! Hi! Let's leave at once! Let's eat at once first! Yummy! I will never be able to make the blue one, the green one, because uh, there's n uh, it's impossible to obtain lapis in here. Uh, I don't think I can use brown uh, in place of the reddish, uh, purplish, brownish one. Uh, because we need cocoa beans, I don't, don't think, I'm pretty sure they can't be obtained in super flat. Yeah, villagers don't trade them. So, no brown either, although there's dirt for that. Yeah, I could, I could uh, use dirt for the for that one uh, <laughs> unknown color. Yeah, I suppose so. What else? What else? Uh, I can instead... Oh, uh, uh, yes, I can instead make uh, red, orange and yellow because I should be able to use bone meal on grass to grow flowers. Um, I can't make the green one because there's no cacti in here. Uh, but uh, and I can't make uh, purple without the blue. I can, however, make uh, the black and the white one. Of course, for the wool, I will need to either be lucky enough to have uh, sheep spawning, in which case I would be extremely happy, or otherwise I will need to farm many, many spiders. <sighs> I'm not exactly happy with that, but hey, whatever, whatever I say. Mm. Oh, and also I might as well make the queue. I have one queue in real life, uh, uh, a pool queue. I really like it. <laughs> it's something very precious that I have. Uh, why it may not be extremely professional, pro professional or anything, it is my cue. And it's a white one with a black, uh, uh, with black uh, symbols on it and stripes and stuff. So it should be, it, it can be easily made with the white wool and black wool. Oh, of course, for the black I will need uh, uh, squids, so I will need to make some kind of lake somewhere. Uh, uh, a pool in, in, in the middle of a pool. Uh, the <laughs> it's, it doesn't look too good. Probably you shouldn't have a pool table outside in the rain, but hey, whatever I say. More diamonds, please? No diamonds in here. Wow, I have so many saplings now. Uh, another smithy? In the, in the previous episode I kept... I kept not seeing smithies. Jeez. I bet I... Mi I, I missed so many... Ah, I bet I missed so many diamonds on my way here. Ah, 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 embarrassing. I think it's everything. Uh, yeah, no, it's not everything. What am I saying? On top of the pool table, I'm planning on making, you know, as, uh, the the balls as I mentioned, and I might as well make them uh, into houses, villagers' houses, so they will live inside the giant balls. <laughs> I bet they can't wait for that. Mm. Yep, so a typical, there are many different kind of uh, pool tables depending on exactly what kind of rules you're playing with or... Th there are many 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 rules even though there are official ones uh, I think, uh, how many official kind of... well depending on who makes them official <laughs> there are many <laughs> So confusing. Uh, different rules and different kind of tables, but uh, uh, the one thing we just need to keep in consideration is that uh, all 
sizes of tables are always have one side that is exactly twice uh, twice as long as the other side so say we're going to make you know, say a pool table can be eight foot on one side on one side and four foot uh, uh, long for the other mm, eight foot is 2.4 meters and four foot are 1.2 meters you are welcome Uh, for completely changing the subject here <laughs> I have tried for the first time uh, to play with a snapshot uh, well I mean not for the first time but uh, I mean for the first time a snapshot that came out after 1.3.1 2 sorry and for the first time ever not including all the times I've been playing while recording I've been playing Minecraft without at the same time listening to music Oh, it's that special? I was just so happy to hear all the new sounds. All the footstep sounds, all the mob sounds. Those are wonderful. I'm very happy for that addition. Even though I guess many people just don't care about them, I am one that really cares about sounds. Oh, talking about sounds. Uh, I have a, head, a blue headband on my head, on my skin. And I have added that for a specific reason. The reason is... <laughs> this makes for another story. Pretty awkward one, actually. I have a set of headphones uh, with a microphone on it. And the, the, that is the microphone I use for recording. Uh, I am a very poor girl. <laughs> so I... My microphone and headphones are kind of cheap and I can't afford to buy. Oh, really? Really? <laughs> uh, chunk error count. I think, yeah, that's the second one we've seen in this challenge here. So, yeah, I have these headphones, they're not very good qual quality. The sounds are kind of fine, but the recording, uh, my microphone uh, has really troubles uh, recording stuff, so I have to amplify the sounds in the course a lot, uh, otherwise uh, my voice can't be heard, so I, that causes lots of the background noises you, you can hear sometimes, and I have troubles cleaning, removing completely. But not only that, but those headphones are too big for my head. Update light. Ah, they're a bit too big for my head. They are, they are for, I guess, a male, adult, human being. <laughs> uh, and these, um, I had the troubles with my headphones. That I noticed in my recording, it often sounds like I'm slamming my headphones with with my hands. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I never do that. I was pretty sure. I never did that while recording, so I couldn't figure out why I could hear those noises sometimes in my recordings. And it turns out that it's simply me shaking my head a little bit. Because of how big my headphones are, um, it would sound like I was head banging and my, my microphone would pick up this vroom, vroom, vroom sound and was annoying as heck. So as I said, I don't, I can't afford to buy, to buy a new uh, set of headphones. But uh, what I could afford instead was to put <laughs> a headband on my head to keep the headphones in place even if they are too large for my head. So yes, I am recording with this, with this blue headband on my head. It probably looks incredibly ridiculous, but at least I should be able to move my head around however I please without it uh, sounding awful and uh, well since it's so ridiculous and stuff I decided to pay a tribute to that and I put a blue headband uh, on my character <laughs> so there you have it ah money 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 I do have a job I should get paid soon so well I will not have the money to buy well it's almost sunset so I might as well enter that church well I don't have the money to buy any computer 
even though I really need it or new headphones even though I really need them I can try to fix the problem the issues I have now with what I do have now so let's summarize what happened today here we managed managed to find our first diamonds but there's only two of them so yeah I could make an enchanting table with those but um, Meh, <laughs> I might as well travel a bit more and try to find more diamonds because finding raw diamonds uh, in smithy's chests is the only way to get them. Villagers don't trade them, although villagers do trade, oh don't fall down, do trade the diamond armor and tools. I have so much gold on me, that's cool, I can make a couple of golden apples. I will not make one and eat one right now because it would be a waste since I'm only wasting, uh, since I'm only missing one heart and a half. And I still am missing the obsidian needed for both the enchanting table and uh, the, the nether portal. I just realized that I can get black wool from the uh, villagers' lampposts, so I don't necessarily need to farm squids for their insects. Though it's, though it's probably something we'll still do. We will think about it. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next episode. Good night! That is a very dangerous place to get out from the bed. Wow.